What's going on, foreigners slash foreign fam? It is your boy Foreign. Welcome back to you guys with another video. Now, if you guys can't tell, I do look different, and that is because I have a new hairstyle. If you guys want to learn how to get this hairstyle, I will have a video on that coming very soon for you guys, so make sure you guys stay tuned. Now, as you guys know by the title, I am doing the Cop or Drop February 2018 edition. You guys already know I've been doing these videos in the past, but I kind of slowed down on these videos because I haven't really been copying shoes. There really hasn't been nothing that caught my eye, but February, there's some heat coming out. There's a lot of shoes, a lot of cops, a little bit of passes. I'm not gonna lie, there's a lot of heat coming out, so let's get straight into the video. Without further ado, man, February 2018 Cop or Drop edition coming right now. Let's get it. All right, man, I have my dog Mono with me today again. A lot of you guys loved during the last Video that I had her in so I brought her back but before we get into it I do have a small announcement I do have a pair of zebra Yeezy size 10 you guys already see I have the box with them too they look super like brand new only one one time outside as you guys can see the boost is still white nothing wrong with them the only reason why I'm selling these is because they're a half size too small I do need a ten and a half in V2 that's kind of weird because I'm a nine and a half in Jordans but I need a ten and a half in V2s that's because these run super small so if you guys want these the best way to reach me is on my Instagram DMs you guys already know where that is at the bottom of the screen either on this side or on that side but if you guys want these make sure you guys DM me so yeah size 10 basically brand new all right man so now that I got that out of the way about to get straight into the video let's get it hello Let's go. All right, man, so I have my phone right here with an app that I'm not going to shout out because they do not sponsor me. So we're going to get into the first shoe. Are y'all ready? Hold on, y'all ready? I don't think y'all ready, man. We about to get into some heat, bro. There's some heat. There's a lot of shoes coming out. I ain't going to lie. Jordan Brand is trying to break our pockets this month, but it's all good, man. I'm going to cop what I can, and that's going to be that. All right, starting off with the first shoe is going to be the Los Angeles Jordan 9s, releasing February 3rd. Now, that shoe, I kind of have mixed emotions with. The Jordan 9 is a okay shoe in my opinion it's not one of my favorite jordans that colorway is nice though so i don't know to be honest with you guys i never owned a pair of jordan nines before and i'm looking at the materials on the shoe and i'm not a big fan of the materials the retail price for these shoes is going to be 190 and like i said they release on february 3rd so if you guys want them you guys can go ahead and cop them they're probably going to be released to the public they're going to be a mad gr but i'm going to have to go ahead and pass on those man i do not like those at all i'm gonna be honest with you guys the colorway look nice but the materials and just the shoe in general i just not a fan of so that's that shoe moving on to the next shoe let's get it. also before i move on to the next shoe i do have a p.o box if you guys do not already know you guys can send me whatever you guys want i want you guys to send me some lit stuff so that i can have lit fan mail videos for you guys i want you guys to send whatever you guys want it could be fan art fan mail it could be letters it could be anything you guys want to for the videos that will be coming soon so make sure if you guys want to send me anything the address to my p.o box will be in the description down below so now that we got that little portion out of the way let's move on to the second shoe let's get it. getting into the second shoe is a shoe that i really want but it's going to be really hard to get it is going to be the nike air foam posit one big bangs now as you guys see by like pictures these are so fire it kind of reminds me of the galaxy phones which are going for like over a thousand dollars right now and i believe these are going to go for like around that price or maybe more as well they released february 4th of so the day after the jordan 9's release and they are retailing for 200 thirty dollars so if you guys want those they're gonna be pretty hard to get i know they released before i believe in boston just at one store i could be wrong i think these are the shoes and now i guess they're releasing them more to the public but they're still gonna be pretty hard to get so if you guys want those uh, i don't know if there's gonna be raffles for them but get them however you can they're gonna be worth a lot of money in the future so that's that shoe that's gonna be a cop for me if i can get it but if i can't you know it is what it is, but I definitely want to cop that shoe. So yeah, that is that shoe. Moving on to the next shoe. Let's get it. All right, man, moving on to the next shoe. And if you guys notice that I skipped a couple shoes, like if you guys know a shoe's coming out, that's just because I don't have interest in the shoe at all. Like if it's an Adidas tubular, I'm going to pass it up. Like it's just shoes that I know will be like kind of hype, like Jordans or Yeezys or something like that. Just because shoes like LeBron's, I'm not going to point out. So anyways, moving on to the next shoe is going to be the Jordan 7 fadeaway releasing february 10th for 190 dollars that is an okay shoe i'm not a big fan of jordan 7s as you guys know i don't have any jordan 7s in my collection at all the colorway is pretty nice it's a little bit too much red i mean i have these so i can't really say that but it, it is a little bit too much red it's a bright red so that will be a drop for me if you guys want those though go ahead and go cop them they're most likely going to be a major gr like released to the public for a lot of people but you know if you like them cop what you like it's not all about the hype all the time but definitely those are going to be a major gr in my opinion so yeah that's that shoe it's going to be a drop for me like i said but anyways moving on to the next shoe 
Okay, moving on to the next shoe. It is a basketball shoe, and the only reason why I'm putting it in this is because I definitely want to get this shoe. I have a PlayStation 4 myself. I'm a big PlayStation fan, so by saying that, you guys should already know what it is. It is going to be the Nike PG2 PlayStation colorway. Now, these are supposed to be really limited. These are supposed to be going for crazy amounts of money. These released February 10th as well for $110, so not a bad price at all. If I'm going to be able to get my hands on these, I would definitely get these. And you guys should too as well if you guys want them. It is a hooping shoe, so I would use it for hooping even though they're going to be super limited. I won't resell those if I get them. I really like the colorway. I like how they look. And I could definitely see myself hooping in these shoes. So I'm the type of guy to like, if I get a hyped up exclusive basketball shoe like the like these or like the off-white hybrid dunks i would definitely hoop in them because i like being flashy off the court and on the court so if i can get an exclusive hyped up basketball shoe and wear it on court i would definitely do that so that shoe is gonna have to be a cop for me let me know if you guys like that shoe as well let me know if you guys are gonna be going after that shoe let me know what shoes you guys are gonna be going after this whole month in the comment section down below i would definitely want to know what you guys are going for i definitely want to know what you guys like but anyways that's that shoe moving on to the next shoe let's get it all right move on to the next shoe it is a jordan 3 it releases february 14th for 200 dollars it is going to be the air jordan 3 white cement nrg dunk contest so basically it's the white cement 3 but on the bottom the bottom is a translucent sole so basically the the translucent bottom has a red line on the bottom of the shoe and that red line represents the free throw line that Jordan dunked from so the concept is a pretty good it's a pretty good concept I'm not gonna lie but the shoe I'm a big fan of the white cements but a, a Jordan 3 with the icy blue bottom you know it just doesn't feel OG to me in it and I don't like icy blue bottoms that much on Jordan 3's I don't know why I like the classic Jordan 3 bottom it's just too much white for me it's too plain for me so that's gonna have to be a drop like I said they released February 14th for $200 let me know if you guys are going to cop these. I'm going to drop them. I'm not going to be going after these. Maybe I might change my mind on release date. If I go in the mall on the release date and they look better in hand and I'm able to cop them, I might cop them. But for now, it's going to be a drop. But that's that shoe. Move on to the next shoe. All right, man. Moving on to the next shoe. It is two shoes, actually. They released on the same day, February 15th. It is the Nike Kyrie 4 All-Star and then the Nike KD 10 All-Star. So the Kyries are releasing, like I said, February 15th for $120. So if you guys want those, those may or may not sit. In my opinion, I think they may sell out. They might not sell out like as soon as they release, but they may sell out like maybe like after the full day or the next day, they may sell out. And then as well as the KD10s, they released for $150. And I don't know if those will sell out. I know a lot of people aren't a big fan of KD shoes. They're probably not a fan of his shoes just because a lot of people aren't a fan of him because he, you know, is a quote unquote snake, but he's my favorite player. I would say the Kyrie's, I like the Kyrie's a little bit more. So the Kyrie's will be a cop mode. Most likely if I go in the store and they have them and I like them I'll open them and I'll buy them yeah because they're like 110 but the KDs I ain't gonna lie I'm gonna have to drop for those just because I already have a lot of KDs in that colorway I'm not a big fan of I like the Kyrie's a little bit more so the Kyrie's is gonna be a cop and the KDs is gonna be a drop so those two shoes are releasing February 15th the Kyrie's are 120 and then the KDs are 150 so yeah that is what is releasing on that day moving on to the next shoe let's get it all right man moving on to the next shoe is a shoe that I really 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 want now I said I wasn't gonna get no more Jordan 1's but this Jordan 1 right here is a must cop for me I struck out the first two times they released the first time they released it was at Complex Con the second time it was a more wide release at a general but I just still wasn't able to get them it is the Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG Gold Toe now they were first called the Top 3 Gold or Top 3 Complex Con but these are so cold in my opinion I'm not gonna lie they look like they were creased really easy but I will still get them out now I'll, I'll probably wear them a few times but I definitely want to get those. Those are releasing February 16th, the day after the two last basketball shoes that I just said, for $160. So if you guys want those, make sure you guys put in raffles if they allow raffles. Make sure you guys do whatever you guys got to do to get those shoes. Not no dangerous stuff. You guys don't got to go out and kill people for the shoes, but do what you got to do, like put in raffles, wait in lines to get these shoes, because these shoes are super fire, in my opinion. That is going to be a cop for me. So yeah, that is that shoe. Moving on to the next shoe. Let's get it. Okay, moving on to the next two shoes. It is the same shoe, made by the same person, just different colorway. Release on the same day as the ones that I just said, February 16th, is going to be the OVO Jordan 8. Okay, so there's a black colorway and then there's a white colorway. As you guys can see by the pictures, I definitely want to go after the white colorway, if any. I'm not a big fan of 8s, so you guys already know that, but they are both releasing for $225. Like I said, February 16th, if you guys want them, they're probably going to be, uh, they're probably going to be limited. Yeah, most definitely. I know they're releasing on All-Star Weekend, so a lot of people are going to go after those just because it's OVO, Drake, and it's all-Star Weekend. A lot of people are going to want to spend their money. So that is those two shoes. Like I said, the black pair, I'm going to have to pass. Mm. The white pair is a maybe. It may be a cop. It may not be. If I'm able to get my hands on them, yeah. But if not, 
I'm not gonna be mad at it. So yeah, that is also the shoes that is releasing February 16th. Moving on to the next shoe. All right, man, moving on to the next shoe is a shoe that I've wanted for a long time. A shoe that I already told you guys I was going to be copying. It is releasing February 17th for $200 exactly. It is the Jordan 3 Black Cement. And oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Those are fire. Those are fire in my opinion. I definitely will be copying those. If I'm able to get two pairs, I might get two pairs. They're most likely going to be a GR, so a lot of people are going to be having them and a lot of people are going to be wearing them. So I definitely want to get a pair that I can just wear a lot and then a pair that, you know, will go for a lot later in the future that I'm just going to keep dead stock for a long time. So. That shoe is definitely going to be a cop, like I said, February 17th for $200. The Jordan Cement 3s, black cements, by the way. So that is that shoe. It's going to be a cop. Y'all already know I'm going to have to cop those. But anyways, that's that shoe. <laughs> Move on to the next shoe. All right, man. Moving on to the next three shoes. It's releasing February 23rd for $250 each is the Pharrell pack, the Pharrell NMD pack. And now, I'm not going to lie, if I'm able to get my hands on these, I'll definitely get at least two pairs. If I can get two pairs, I'll definitely get two pairs. I'll get one pair that I can just have in my collection, and then the other pair I'll definitely resell because they're going to be going for a lot of money. I'm already knowing that. The first colorway is called the Blank Canvas Black. The second one is called the Blank Canvas Cream. And then the last one is called the Blank Canvas. That's all it's called. It's nothing else to it. So, I definitely want to go after the black pair. If I can get the black pair, I'll definitely get those just because, you know, it's easier it won't get dirty or nothing like that so i definitely have to go with those so that one it will be a cop the other two will be a drop mm. i'm not a fan of the other two i'm a i'm a high beast just a little bit but if it's an ugly shoe or if it's like a colorway that i don't like i will not cop it most likely most likely but not all the time so i'll definitely go up to the black pair so yeah those are those three shoes move on to the next one the next shoe that is releasing is another jordan one now i said i do not want to cop any more jordan ones because they look long on my feet i said that in my sneaker collection video but these jordan ones i ain't gonna lie i'm definitely gonna have to cop they released in february 24th for 160 dollars it is going to be the air jordan one og bread toes now as you guys can see by the pictures they look so cold it's like a it's like a bread and a black toe kind of combined so i definitely want those it's a clean shoe it's a very nice colorway the only thing the only bad thing about the ones is they look long on my feet but for a colorway like that and a shoe like that i'm gonna definitely have to work with it and i'm gonna have to cop it so that will be a cop for me like i said february 24th for 160 dollars make sure you guys go put in your raffles because they will sell out most og jordan ones sell out like the royals the black toes the breads top threes most og jordan ones with the nike airs do sell out so if you guys want those definitely put in your raffles definitely wait in line for them because they will sell out no doubt okay so that is a cop for me. Moving on to the next shoe. Okay. All right, man. So moving on to the next shoe is another Jordan 3. And it's a little bit of a different Jordan 3. I never released before. It is releasing on the same day, February 24th for $200. It is the Air Jordan 3 Tinker NRG. So that model was supposed to be the Jordan 3 that was supposed to come out like a years back when the Jordan 3 first came out. That was the whole idea, the whole sketch of the shoe that was supposed to be coming out. And then they came out with the Jordan 3s that we know today. So basically that shoe that you guys see on the screen right now was the Jordan 3 that should have came out, but it never did hold on my dog went in my closet all right man what was i at so yeah basically that jordan 3 that you guys see on the screen was supposed to be the model in the way that the jordan 3s are supposed to be looking today but then they came out with the new jordan 3s that we know as today so they're finally bringing out this shoe and a lot of people are trying to go after those in my opinion i'm not a big fan of how they look but if i get them in hand and they feel good or and they look better in hand i will most likely cop them but right now it's i, I don't know it's a drop mm. and a cop i guess you could say i have mixed emotions with the shoe i never seen a jordan 3 with the nike sign on it before but like i said it was supposed to be the jordan 3 that came out but they never did so i don't know like i said it's a drop and a cop so that's that shoe moving on to the next shoe. All right, man, moving on to the next two shoes is also a basketball shoe. Now, I normally don't like Adidas basketball shoes, but the hype beast is coming out in me. Releasing February 24th, the same day as the last two shoes I just mentioned, is going to be the Bet Times Adidas Damian Lillard 4 collab. And as you guys see by the pictures, there's a green colorway and then there's a black colorway. Now, obviously, I like Bape. You guys know I already have a Bape shirt. So just by that shoe having Bape on it just makes it a plus for me. So the green pair is a cop. The black pair is going to be a cop as well if I'm able to get them. Like I said, they released February 24th for $150. A bait collab retails for $150, so I definitely will have to cop those. 
If I'm able to get my hands on both of them, that would be a cop. But if I can't, I won't be too mad. I'm just going to hoop in them anyways, to be honest. But moving on to the last shoe. Let's get it. All right, man. Moving on to the last shoe. We're going to end it off with a bang. This shoe is releasing February 27th for $190. It is the Off-White Times Jordan 1 collab in the white colorway. Now, it would be a cop for me, but I heard that it is only exclusive to, like, Europe. It's a Europe exclusive or some weird stuff like that. So, the U.S. will not be able to get the shoe unless you, like, have a plug in the Europe or like UK or something like that but yeah these shoes are only releasing I guess I've heard I could be wrong but if they release in the US I'm gonna be trying to go after them but you know they're, they're releasing in Europe which a lot of people said so that'll be a drop for me but if I'm able to get them you know I would obviously cop them but yeah anyways that is the end of the video if you guys enjoyed make sure you guys smash the like button let's get 2500 likes on the video make sure you guys subscribe to join the foreigner slash foreign fam also make sure you guys hit that bell too so you're notified whenever I post a video merchandise is coming soon I will be showing you guys the merchandise when I get it in hand in the video I'm gonna show you guys the quality how it looks and everything that I'm gonna be sending you guys to the website all right man moving on to the post notification winner it is going to be jeremiah i do not know how to say your last name so i'm gonna just say jeremiah t he said post notifications turned on he said bro it's crazy i've been watching and watching and never knew you were about to hit 100k keep up the good work and continue grinding and please keep this series going i love it so shout out to you bro the series that he is talking about is the reacting to the subscribers whatever series and i will be continuing that series as long as you guys love the series and keep making the videos go up and liking the video so yeah shout out to you jeremiah like i said it is the end of the video so hopefully you guys enjoyed me and vision 5 will be going to sneaker con bay area march 31st to april 1st so make sure you guys copy your tickets come say what's up to us get in the vlogs get lit buy some merch do whatever you guys want to do i'm gonna get on out of here it's been your boy foreign boy shout out to the foreigners slash foreign fam we're on the way to 100k make sure you guys share our channel make sure you guys get us to 100k by the end of january we have a couple more days left please get us there that is my goal and then the next goal is 200k then you know 500k by the end of the year so it's been your boy foreign boy hope you guys enjoy the hair that video is coming soon and i'm out let's get it Hi.